Hey everyone, welcome back. Today, as anticipated, we are going to do the dirt hog pay dirt. So I've never done dirt hog before. I've uh, I've heard good things about them. Um, I'm not loyal to anybody. This is the two pound caribou claim mix. So uh, we're just gonna open it up and um, let's see what's in it. This is part of my uh, midwinter blues doing some pay dirt. So what the heck. So I'm going to classify this to the quarter inch screen. Any goodies on top? I don't see any. Make sure we get all the goodness out of this. Looks to be about it. noticeable nice piece of quartzy material there just sift it with my fingers here and see if anything comes to my eye nothing too noticeable so we'll just uh, give this a bit of a shake here I'll wet wash that later, see if there's anything attached to it. So I will be double panning this. As you can see, I got the pan with some jet dry in it with water. I'll just wet the material down here. layers off, get all wet and still a amount of clay in there. there. Should break it up, yeah. I want to take off the first little bit and bring it all back. This golden pan I like because I don't know if you can see it, but it's got that ridge there. So it's, it's a nice vertical little ridge, and I find that gold gets trapped there almost instantly. Anything that goes above that somehow will get caught in the the riffles above and then you just bring it back. I think I already saw some gold there. Oh, look at that. You guys see that right there? And on the other side too. Look at that. Must be doing something right. Now we just want to be a little more careful.
looking really closely at the bottom. Oh, look at all those garnets. Can you see all that? Wow. Look at that. I don't know if you can see that or not. Tons of them. Very cool. But we'll recover those later. We want the yellow. I want the yellow. Tons of garnets. So there's the gold now. I just saw the first flake appear right there, so I'm going to bring it back. And just slowly pan out the plates. I'll separate the garnets and show you guys the end results. It might be a little more tedious, I think. Alright, let's bring this back here. Do a swirl here for you. Flaky gold likes to move a little more, I think, because of the surface area. Look at all that. That's nice. I like to spread it out a bit and Lead? No, that's not lead. This, I'm not sure what that is. That could be lead. It's sticking in the pan. Once you figure out that right little wave, none of the gold moves. You can just carry that black sand away.
pretty cool. All right, I'm gonna clean this up and uh, I'll show you guys kind of the end results here. So this here is definitely a picker. Makes that sound. That's a good problem to have when the gold is so big it won't fit in the sucker hole. All right, the only way I can do this is just pick it up and put it in. So, concerning all those garnets I found in that sample, I uh, actually didn't bother to pan it because well, there's just too many of them. I didn't feel like back panning it, and I figured uh, I'd try a couple of tricks I've uh, heard from you guys over the years. There's a big one there. Yeah, you can almost pick them up. I think they're still low enough quality that uh, they're not really worth anything, but they're fun to get out, so we'll try that. Anyways, I, I did pick out a few of them. And you can see that they're, they're nice, they're pretty, so. Uh, I'm going to do that in another video. Uh, maybe if you want it in the comments, tell me how you would get the garnets out other than back panning. I've heard a couple of tricks like putting uh, Vaseline on a cleanup mat. Uh, that's supposed to catch diamonds, so I don't see why it wouldn't catch garnets. But yeah, anything you guys ever heard, maybe uh, ask some old timers what they did. Or I don't even know if these things are worth it or not, but we'll do a video on it later. So it looks like 1.17 grams of gold. Yeah, it's not too bad actually. There's some uh, decent uh, sized gold in there. There's uh, a couple of specimens in there that have some type of mineral attached to the gold. I'll, I'll take some uh, macro photos with my hockey lens and uh, you can see what they look like uh, at the end of the video. So yeah, cool. Yeah, so doing that pay dirt was uh, a lot of fun. Uh, I might get some more dirt hog in the future and uh, see what goes down with that. The, the gold was pretty good. There's a ton of garments in there, so like I said, we'll do a we'll do a follow up video because I want to see if there's some other ways. I know some guys might just want to go on the river just to get garnets, so if there's an easier way to do that, we'll see if it, we can figure that out. So let's do that. I know there's lots of uh, pay dirt reviews out on the uh, YouTube right now and uh, I follow a couple of them and they do a really good job, probably a, a better job than me in fact at uh, doing this. I just do this for, you know, the, trying to pass the winter blues. So we're in 2019 now and I'm looking forward to doing a lot of things uh, this year. Just getting out with a lot of friends and having some fun and that's really what it's all about, isn't it? So yeah, if you like videos like this, uh, please hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell icon to notify you when uh, new videos come out. So by the time this video comes out, uh, I'm pretty sure I will have passed 1,000 subscribers, which is uh, something of a milestone in uh, YouTube. So uh, I'd just like to say thank you to all you guys. Uh, stay tuned. Um, I'm going to see if I can do a uh, kind of a special video there. and I might do a bit of a, a giveaway or a mystery box or uh, maybe there'll be some uh, gold in it for sure so uh, yeah stay tuned for that and um, like I said I appreciate all your guys' comments um, you could probably find me mostly I, I do have that website uh, goprospecting.ca you can also see uh, find me on on uh, Facebook go prospecting it's an interactive group it's open to everyone and just uh, share your ideas your pictures what you've been up to and just interesting stuff i try to put uh, lots of interesting stuff i come across and share it to that page so yeah thanks like i said thanks to everyone who uh, watches and uh, subscribes and uh, this uh, this is only the beginning and we will uh, see where this uh, fun thing takes us so yeah take care guys see you out there
Hey guys, welcome to what is blah 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 blah. Hey everyone, hope you're all doing well. Blah 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 blah.